She ain't got no money in the bank. What's going on guys, Jack95Gamer here and I'm back for episode 74 of my West Ham United career mode and guys before getting to this episode you could be so ever kind to hit that like button if you are enjoying the series and if you're new around here then why not hit that subscribe button too guys, it is free and it only takes a couple seconds out of your day and it really does help me out. But without further ado now we get into these uh, this, uh, this episode and unfortunately we do meet with some bad news as Arturo Alfonso Gonzalez does reject the contract offer we have offered him and he said he's going to take a couple of time or a few weeks to uh, decide his future with the club which is absolutely gutting you know we really don't want to lose such a great bright prospect like uh, Gonzalez you know he scored some stunning goals here in his time at West Ham you know he spent nearly three seasons here you know this would be his third season here when he if he does complete it so we hope to keep him at the club but we do have an important game to concentrate on that is Watford who obviously did start up last season um, they're a good side, it's going to be interesting to see how they do this is their second season in the Barclays Premier League and they're looking to establish, establish themselves as a Barclays Premier League side. Can they do it? Only time will tell as Dini gets onto the ball. It would be Watford that see the first bit of action in this game as Leon would play it back into Duncan, back into Leon again. He does play into space to find, uh, I don't know who that was, but it does go safe into the hands of Perrin there. The game's still at nil nil. It would be Watford though with the next attack of the game as they put the ball into the box. It would find the head of, I'm not too sure that was either, but it does go wide and mark there. But Watford are threatening. But West Ham get their first attack of the game. 37 minutes into this one too also. So it comes quite late at Vicarage Road here. As Henderson puts the ball over the top, we would find the right back for Bino across into the box. Too fine for Vieto. And the informed striker had to put that ball over the bar there. But again, he come closer to getting another goal adding to his tally. As Duncan gets on the ball now for Watford. Great bit of play here from Dini as he plays it into Igalo. But Perrin does hold on to this one. Game still remains at 0-0 and right at the end of the half it will be Watford on the attack as they put the ball over the top here. It would find Leon who plays it back into Belkalem. Belkalem would find Dini. Dini cuts inside a great little play there from the Watford striker who puts it just wide of the mark there. As West Ham do win a free kick though on the edge of the box, it would be Nabil Fakir trying to test uh, Gomez who gets his shot away and it just goes wide of the mark there. The game still at 0-0. West Ham trying to find a breakthrough here but Watford have absolutely played out their socks here and put in a great performance as they link up here. We'll go to their man who puts it into the back of the net to make it Watford 1, West Ham 0 at Vicarage Road. The, you can't argue, it was it was coming. It really was. The ball, and great bit of play here from Watford. They split us apart as Mora Vec does get the goal. Five goals in Barclays Premier League this season and that's an important goal for Watford as I do like my free kick here to make it 2-0. Great free kick hits the post and Perrin was caught scrambling across his line. Unfortunately uh, for Watford, it does um, end up going into a West Ham break. It's Henderson would find Ener Valencia. Valencia gets past his man with easy. Ener Valencia now right at the attack uh, of the defence gets his shot away. It just goes over the bar there. West Ham struggling to find that goal we really are and it's, it's looking frustrating here for us as we do bring on Bahuli uh, along with Gonzalez and uh, other players Mark Noble Vince onto the ball now what can he do he puts the ball over the top looking for Lucio Vieto Vieto takes the ball down with ease it's Lucio Vieto can he save us what a save that is from Gomez and guys a corner would come in here headed away from Musacchio it falls into Savage Savage uh, finds Ekstrand Ekstrand what can he do here uh, he's, he's with the ball, he's moving it away, gets his shot away, goes over the bar, but guys, that'll be how the game finishes. Watford do get a 1-0 win here over the Hammers, and unfortunately, it is a loss here for us. And uh, it's gutting. It really is. A tough pill to swallow, but, you know, we can't take anything away from Watford. Uh, they put in a great performance, and they deserve the three points in. Hilario Gomez does pick up man match with a 7.9 rating. Uh, he made four shots, a call and two parried. A good performance from the Watford goalkeeper, and he um, was definitely part of the reason why they did, obviously, um, get the result here today. But as you can see, Gonzalez does have a major contract problem. He will not be entertaining a thought of a new contract, and that is disappointing. We'll go into a new contract. We're going to offer him one last one. Hopefully, we'll accept it, but... Do actually become Brazil national team manager. Won't see much of that. That's purely just for scouting purposes. I'll probably uh, won't won't even keep on with the job. I'm just going to look and see what players um, are worth my time scouting. But we do offer Gonzalez a 40 grand a week contract, five grand on what he's demanded, and hopefully that'll be enough to see the Mexican commit his future to the club. We really want him to stay here, but. He does start in this game along with Henderson and Martin Bahuli in midfield. Vio Wilson do start up front. Bellerin, Moore, Shah, Grimaldo and Schmeichel make up the defence. But yeah, I'm hoping really that Gonzalez does sign that contract and does really put uh, the rumours to bed that he's not leaving because you know he's a great talent. He's got a great future ahead of him. And 
I want his future to be at West Ham. But this Everton team was Tim Howard, Coleman, Alcaraz, Jagielka, Baines, Gibson, McCarthy, Naismith, Morales, Insopia, and Aruna. Kind of the likes of Ross Barkley on the bench, uh, Besic and John Stones. John Ruddy playing up backup goalkeeper for Everton here. It's going to be an interesting game. Everton a bit of a bogey side for the Hammers, but we're looking to uh, get the win here. As Gonzalez gets on the ball, looking to make a, um, impress me, really. He gets on the ball here. Great bit of play, and he hits the crossbar from range. That was a great effort there from Gonzalez, but unfortunately, the game still remains at 0-0. The crossbar comes to Everton's aid here, but Bahuri does fantastically well. He's a football over the top. He would find James Wilson and gets past Jack Yelka. Tries to put it past Tim Howard, but a great save from the American there. will keep the game at 0-0. But West Ham will continue their attack here, and that what. Loss was really a kick up the backside for these guys as they're looking to perform here. And what performance is looking like as Wilson gets his shot away, and that is a ludicrous goal there from the England striker James Wilson. What a finish that is, and that could be up there as one of the goals of the season. Uh, he had no right to take that shot on, you know. It was just, everyone was just inviting him to take that shot on. That was like, go on, big boy, take this shot. They back off him, back off of him. Howard doesn't even see it coming. Top corner. What a finish that is from James Wilson. Look at this, you know, into the top corner. Argue the goalkeeper could have done a little bit better, but James Wilson gets his third goal of the BPL season, and by far that is the most, um, the best one that stands out for him. He gets on the ball yet again, he doubled his goal tally. He does fall to Vieto, gets the ball here, tries to take on Alcaraz, who gets his shirt pulled, goes down in the box. Referee points straight to the spot. West Ham, you know, I do win the penalty here, and Everton's uh, afternoon could get a lot worse as Vieto steps up here. Tim Howard gets sent the wrong way as Vieto does double alley to make it 2 0, and the red hot informed striker gets his fourth goal in three games. Unbelievable play here from Luciano Vieto. And, you know, he's really hit the form at the right time. You know, I, I said a few episodes back that, you know, he's a player that is always in a round point performance that doesn't really get the goals to show for it. But now it looks like he's settling. He's getting the goals to show for it. Eight goals in the BPL already this season. Well played for him. As we give the ball away, though, to Charles and Zogbia. The Everton man will get onto the ball here. Does really well as he gets his shot away. Schmeichel will make the save and will get cleared away from Gonzalez here. So uh, the Hammers do get clear of that dangerous. But who now gets us on the counter attack? What can we do here? Wilson tries to make the run here and he has got the pace to hurt Jagielka. Gets past the field Jagielka, the England centre back. Does really well here. Gets the shot away. But what a block that is from England International to block that to keep the game at 2-0. But into the second half, that West Ham will win the corner. It gets clear from McCarthy to find Hector Bellerin. Bellerin lines up a shot from range, and that would have been a stunning goal that found the back of there. Had Howard scrambling across his line, but nothing really causing the threat here. As Marty gets onto the ball, he would find Luciano Vieto. What can Vieto do now? The Argentine's been in great form this game. He gets his shot away, and again, another great save there from Tim Howard to keep the game at 2 Nil from the corner, Gonzalez would link up with Grimando. Grimando would play into space to find Jordan Henderson with the shot. And what a save that is from Tim Howard yet again. As we do bring on Mark Noble, Neil Mapay, and Chiku Kayute. 2 0 with 20 minutes left to go in this game. We'll see how this one would finish. The next goal would probably be crucial in this one. It's been all West Ham though. So can we see it going one way at the moment as Mighty lines up a shot from range. Great save there from Tim Howard. And he would get onto the follow up there to keep, keep the parry shot into his arms. Alcaraz heads the ball only as far as James Wilson though. And Wilson would um, give back to McCarthy only to win it back here. Clammy defending here from Everton. It would fall nil to Neil Mopay, who puts it agonisingly past Tim Howard and Leighton Baines' reach to make it 3-0 to the Howards. Number 22, Neil Mopay. What a season he's having, though. He comes off the bench and he gets yet another goal for the Hammers there. Look at that. That's agonising for Leighton Baines to get there. But what a finish that is from the Frenchman. And um, completely full Tim Howard. He thought he was going at his near post. And it just goes past his legs there. He gets his second goal in the Barclays Premier League this season. Neil Mopay is off to an absolute flyer in his West Ham career at the moment. As we win the ball back here from a great chance from Chiku Kayute, who would play through Neil Mopay yet again. Straight through the middle here. It's Neil Mopay. Surely not another. Takes it round. Tim Howard, 4-0 to the Hammers, Neil Mapay has arrived, West Ham United 4, Everton 0, it's been an absolute slaughtering of the Blues here, and what great bit of play here from Neil Mapay. it really was, uh, it all come from a Chiku Kayute, it was, it was an absolute beastly challenge on Leighton Baines in the middle of the park here, freed up the space for Neil Mapay, allowed him to get the shot away, but West Ham would win the corner, Neil Mapay would link up with Bahuli, Bahuli shoots, great save there from Howard, it will fall to Kayute, Kayute with the shot, again another great save there from Tim Howard, keep the game at 4-0, as Bahuli gets the ball into the 90th minute phase, and James Wilson, Wilson takes on the whole defence, gets the shot away at the near post, 5-0 to the Hammers, Everton have been well and truly 
destroyed here. They have been absolutely dismantled and West Ham are showing that they are the champions elect this season. What a finish that is. Forget the 1-0 loss to Watford. We can forget about that because we have just slaughtered Everton 5-0 and shows that West Ham are back. We are focused and we are not going to let ourselves lose a game like that again. What play here? The fans are obviously in great voices. We do walk out of here. The 5-0 winners. Two for Neil Mapay. Two for Wilson and one for Luciano Vieto. One shot for Everton on the night, on the afternoon, should I say. And they've been absolutely destroyed. Look at that. Take a picture of that and frame it. West Ham, absolutely dominant. Tim Howard picks up man of match because despite conceding five goals, he would make uh, 14 saves in that game. Um, great bit of play from him. Unfortunately, his defence just did not help him. But we go into uh, our final two games of the Champions Cup. We're looking in a very good position. Three points ahead of FC Bayern. Still got Napoli and FC Basel. Uh, Napoli and Bayern, should I say, left the place. So that's going to be interesting to see. I'm going to leave you guys looking at the Barclays Premier League table. If you did enjoy the video, guys, as always, make sure to do smash that like button. I would really appreciate it. If you're new around here and you haven't already, then why not hit that subscribe button too, guys? It is free. It really would help my channel grow. And it only takes a couple seconds out of your day. The Hammers are joint top of the table with Chelsea, with Manchester United, just a couple of points behind. It looks like it could still be a three-legged race going into this season yet again. But as always, guys, have a really nice day. I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.